謝るくらいならやんじゃねえって話だよ嫌な相手だったら張り倒してるしそもそも髪一本触らせたりしねえし Sure about that? You're like five feet. Ah, I saw some Yasin Nicola do Monjanezo. Where the hell did the honest advocate come from? Come, wait, where the hell did the honest advocate from before go? I guess she's back to being normal. Haughty out of the key again. Well, I guess it's just who you are. I pet as a key of the small Riley. I press a button move. She pouts as she, her face flushes. She sounds a bit dejected. It makes me a little sad that she gets this caddy afterward. Even though she has called me master only a little while ago. Well then. My bad. I'm really sorry. I would never do that to you again, Azuki. Can you forgive me? I ask her, dead serious. Aha. I can tell by her serious tone that even she's not so sure about it herself. I'm not sure how to respond. I decided to wait for her to continue. Yeah, I realize that. Tears well up at her eyes as she apologizes in her usual and sincere fashion. She can be annoying sometimes, but that's one of the things that makes her so cute. And the fact that she's a very carry person beneath it all makes her even more adorable. Her lack of confidence while putting on a strong face is cute too. I gently stroke Azuki's hair, and the chuckle wells up inside of me. I understand, it's alright, because I love you too, Azuki. And that's the one I'm using. A blissful smile creeps across her face, and she nods slightly in response. Now then, I get lonely sometimes, so I wouldn't mind if you came to sleep over every now and then. How do you get lonely? Whenever you feel like it, every once in a while or whatever. As I give her this intentionally vague invitation. It's not that vague, dude. I gently rub her cheek. As she pushes her cheek into my palm, she lets out a faint laugh that I can barely hear, even at this close distance. This tiny cat girl before me is truly adorable. I embrace her delicate body. Well, if we're going to be seeing each other more often every once in a while, I think she'll sleep a little closer to me. Sometimes, 
Good night, Azuki. In the moonlit room, with the curtains closed, I hug my childish little cat Penny tightly. As he stirs slightly, she brings her lips to my ear. What's up? Yeah, I feel the same. Her gentle purring resounds throughout the room as she presses her forehead up against my body. And the very next day, Shigura knows all about it. <laughs> yep. I called it. <laughs> How do you keep finding out? Better them than you. Oh, my arm is sore. Wait, can I go live a long time? How long is long? Like you mature in a year. This whole situation feels like deja vu. I'm more concerned about my maniacally laughing sister than the deja vu though. Oh, what tipped you off? Was it the other two girls all the day? The other three girls I was fucking? Well, uh, I guess. Sorry? Azuki and coconut and chocolate and vanilla. No, uh, I wasn't really trying for that, but... No, don't do that. Don't do that. What is wrong with you? No, don't. No. Listen to me, Shigure. Go and disturb the neighbors, so lower your voice a bit, okay? Yeah, I realize that. If I can walk away. Yeah, I guess. We watch Sugar is back, helpless. Wait, what? We watch Sugar is back, helpless. I can't believe something like this has happened two days in a row. I guess it just goes to show you never know what will happen down the road. 
Stare off into the distance and tune out your insane laughter. I coconut. You know, Coconut, not, not to upset your vibe or whatever, but I think Vanilla might have her number better than you. She shakes Coconut's hand, a baffled expression on her face. <laughs> I'm probably making an equally, an equally puzzled expression right now. Oh, don't protest too much, sweetheart. That puts you in the curse. <laughs> oh, here she goes again. It's not this game, Cinnamon. You gotta wait till next time. Yeah, I'm with you on this one, Maple. Oh, you, you leave. Go. Go. Leave my kekos alone. You, you shush, you shush. Oh, goodbye. Oh, goodbye to you too. All right, girls, wrap it up. We have work to do. For the second day in a row, I get out the cat living room. If you were to say that this is this is how ah If you were to say that this is how things usually are, you wouldn't be wrong. I mean, this is the second day in a row now. You might not see something like this coming, but that's my rally rally to myself, knowing that ultimately I'm the root of the problem. Let's just get ready to open shop, okay? I need you guys to actually do your jobs now. I watched as they escape to the bakery floor. That really just reached the end of the... Really? Five hours? Really? Really? Tell her nothing.
なんてしももう何も言えねえからほっといてくれああもう畜生惚れたもん負けってこういうことか9つの小豆もよきかなよきかな Okay, enough, enough talking so I can get the pic, like, zoom out more so I can get the full picture. No, no, I'd, I'd rather have coconut. As long as she stopped calling me Oni-chan, I, I would rather her stop calling me that, but I like her more than you two, I'm sorry. ご主人は本当エロパティシエだからしゃあない。本当しゃあない。Oh、uh, well, um, I I care about everyone very much, so. Oh my gosh, she cracked the code. She's seen through the Matrix. <laughs> What does that mean? Jesus. Pumped and dumped, huh? Get, get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Get out. There we go. Full picture. <laughs> Get out while you can, Maple. Alright, so I'm making a steered loop. Come on, guys, we gotta rush, we gotta hurry this up now. Alright, alright, there, there, there. Everyone is in good spirits to prepare to open the cafe for today. I don't know how high spirits Maple is. s i n g s have been pretty busy up to this point. I'm sure things are only going to get even more lively from here on out, too. Well, it is how it is, I guess. I mutter to myself as I'm surrounded by cute. Ooh, excuse me, by cute cat girls. And once more, La Soleil, also known as Kneko Paradise, opens for the day. Credits. Alright. So it's a presently short project. I might go on a bit longer, but oh well. Um, hi, baby. I'm gonna let the credits roll out if they ever get around to it. Jesus. I'm gonna do a bit more talking. Hang on. So, as you guys can tell, we are done with this game. Which means we'll be moving on to the next one soon enough.、Uh, I didn't think I'd be finishing this game so soon, so now I gotta find a replacement game. Oh boy.、Uh, let me look at my shelf real quick. I'll figure something out. Excuse me. Um, yeah, I'll figure something out. I actually don't have a plan at the moment, but you guys will know when I know. 
Oh, you'll, you'll know when I upload it, so, you know, keep an eye out. Uh, did I ever announce the game I'm playing after Tomb Raider? I'm sure I did, but I'll reiterate it. Uh, I'm gonna be starting Batman Arkham City, because I'm, I, it's been a long, long time since I played Arkham, or Arkham Asylum. So we'll be starting that, and I guess we'll be starting something new alongside that too. Oh boy. But uh, yeah, it is currently 2.12 in the morning. I am very tired. My arm hurts quite a bit because I have not been massaging it like I was supposed to, and it's very stiff. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this, uh, this adventure. Um, someday in the distant future, we'll get started on Chapter 3, or Volume 3. Uh, that day won't be any day, anytime soon, as far as I'm aware of, but, you know, we'll get there when we get there. And, as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this project. I hope you guys have been enjoying all my projects so far. I hope you guys stick around and see what I'm coming up. And until then, hope you guys have a great day, have a great night. Get plenty to sleep, get plenty to eat, get plenty to eat. Just, just stay healthy. And I'll see you guys all in our next session, or our next playthrough. Until then... Uh, bye bye